What's up YouTube, this is LDS Reliance. Today we're going to do another Solar Basics video and this time we're going to talk about connectors. Connectors are very important in solar because they provide the continuity between wires and objects. They also uh, speed up the installation process so that you don't have to hardwire everything which, which takes much longer. Connectors also allow for uh, easy disconnecting and so you can move things around and make changes later on. There are many different types of connectors, but uh, we're going to focus on three different types. There are the kind of the mainstream, uh, lower end, all purpose uh, connectors, and then we have solar specific connectors, and then we have connectors or, or lugs that are specific for using to connect to a battery. The connectors shown here are very common, you've probably seen them before, and they're very appropriate for, for solar use, as long as you're not subjecting them to harsh outdoor conditions with UV, uh, sunlight, radiation, and moisture. You could use these types of connectors to connect to the terminals on your charge controller or on your inverter. These butt connectors or bullet connectors are used to connect two wires together where you just put them, put the wires in, the, in either end and then crimp them on. In order to crimp on these types of connectors, you're going to need a wire crimper like shown in this picture. These, these types of tools can also strip the wire, which strips the jacket of the wire back so that you can make a, a metal to metal connection. Before starting your solar project, you may want to order a kit, such as shown in the picture, which comes with a variety of different connectors. You may not know what type of connectors you need before you start the project. There are also solar-specific types of connectors, like this MC4 connector that you see in the picture. These types of connectors protect against UV radiation and moisture, such as humidity and rain, and are designed to go outdoors and are lab tested to, to handle these types of conditions. A lot of solar panels come with MC4 connectors already installed on them, so bear that in mind when you're ordering your panel, you may want to check that out first. If they do, that is a good thing because they are the best connector that I've used for solar panel use. And they're great for being able to connect strings of solar panels together like you see in this picture. Keep in mind that when working with MC4 connectors, they also require special tools, such as these little wrenches that you see here, and then also there are MC4 specific crimping tools available. The last type of connector is only useful for off-grid solar panel systems, and that's a battery lug or battery terminal. These are useful for providing a low resistance connection to your battery bank. Sometimes I see people connecting to their battery bank with alligator clips or jumper cables and those aren't as good because they don't have as much surface area they're not tightly connected on there so they may come off and they may not have that low resistance connection that you want. Here's another type of battery lug that you may need to use depending on what kind of uh, terminals your batteries have. So if you use the right connectors you'll get the most energy out of your solar panel system and you'll be able to easily disconnect and rearrange things later if you need to. Thanks for watching guys, hopefully you learned something.